When you graph a line such as y equals x, the equation y equals x represents all the points on that line. But when you graph the inequality y is greater than or equal to x, you need to include all the points that are greater than y equals x. And you do this by shading the region above the line. This graph represents all the points on y equals x, like negative 2, negative 2, and 2 and 2, and also all the points where the y coordinate is greater than the value at y equals x, like negative 2 and 4, or 2 and 5. Now let's add to the graph the line y is less than or equal to x plus 4. Now we need to shade the region below the line, a new color to represent all the coordinates which have a y coordinate smaller than the above value on the line y equals x plus 4. We can also see that there's an overlap between the shaded region of these two inequalities. The shaded region represents all the values where y is greater than or equal to x and is less than or equal to x plus 4. Now let's add two more inequalities to the graph. y is greater than or equal to negative x minus 2, and y is less than or equal to negative x plus 4. And let's look at the shaded region where all four of these lines overlap. In this region we have a rectangle, and we can represent all the points on this rectangle by using the equation for these four lines.